pick the doc because he dunked on me. <laughs> I always say the dunk. You know, people ask me, why, why didn't you get out of the way? Well, one, I was trying to get out of the way. But two, in the back of my mind, uh, being a defensive player, you always want to have that special moment. And when Dr. J came in and I saw that whole play developing, You know what? And I say this today, if I could have got up, if I could have, would have, should have. I know all of that. But for some reason, if I could have got up in the air because he came at me like this, if I could have got up and got turned, Nick would have been the greatest block of all time. And that's only in my little legendary mind. So, but we we know what happened. You know, Doc done it and just rocked the cradle and all of that. And the one thing I always tell people about that is that uh, they can't show that. They can't show that other than the NBA. But, you know, Doc, I did a, a drink for, um, I think it was Hennessy. And uh, they wanted to use that clip. And uh, they had to call me. And they had to say, hey, Coop, you know what? We're getting ready to, you know, it's a piece for that. We're going to show a part of this clip. Is it okay to use it? I says, well, no, I got to get paid. I got to get something. And they sent me out a nice little paycheck. Uh, it was just a one-time thing. But, you know, at that time, I'm thinking, oh, okay, it's a lot of money. But little did I know they were going to show it 50,000 times. So mm -hmm. I think I paid for the one time. But, you know, Dr. J was a great player. As he, as he lost a little bit of his athleticism, as he got older as a player, Doc started moving in, posting up a little bit more, became a master of that little 12, 13 foot bank shot off the left side. He still had that soaring gracefulness about going to the basket. And, um, you know, you again, when he got up on the basket, it was going to be a dunk. But Doc became a complete player. And I'm not saying that he ever was, but as you lose, uh, as you see LeBron, as you see Magic, as you see Kobe, when they lose that athleticism, they start getting smarter and move closer to the basket and start redefi redefining their game a little bit. And Doc was one of the best at doing that. CLNS History is brought to you by FanDuel, the exclusive wagering partner of the CLNS Media Network.